The Alhambra site is about 700 to 740 meters, 2,300 to 2,430 feet, in length and about 200 to 205 meters, 660 to 670 feet, at its greatest width. It extends from west-northwest to east-southeast and covers an area of about 142,000 meters to 1,530,000 square feet, or 35 acres. It stands on a narrow promontory overlooking the Vega or Plain of Granada and carved by the river Daro on its north side as it descends from the Sierra Nevada. The red earth from which the fortress is constructed is a granular aggregate held together by a medium of red clay which gives the resulting layered brick and stone reinforced construction. Tapiel Calacastrado. Its characteristic hue and is at the root of the name of the Red Hill. The Alhambra's most westerly feature is the Alcazaba, a large fortress overlooking the city. Due to touristic demand, Modern access runs contrary to the original sequence which began from a principal access via the Puerta de la Justicia, Gate of Justice, onto a large souk or public market square facing the Alcazaba, now subdivided and obscured by later Christian-era development. From the Puerta del Vino, Wine Gate, ran the Calle Real, Royal Street dividing the Alhambra along its axial spine into a southern residential quarter, with mosques, hammams, bathhouses, and diverse functional establishments, and a greater northern portion, occupied by several palaces of the nobility with extensive landscaped gardens commanding views over the Albaquin. All of this was subservient to the great tower of the ambassadors in the Palacio Camaras. Camaras Palace, which acted as the royal audience chamber and throne room with its three arched windows dominating the city. The private, internalized universe of the Palacio de los Leones, Palace of the Lions, adjoins the public spaces at right angles. See plan illustration but was originally connected only by the function of the Camara's baths or royal baths. The Mirador de Lindaraja serving as the exquisitely decorated focus of meditation and authority. Overlooking the refined garden courtyard of Lindaraja, Daraxa toward the city. The rest of the plateau comprises a number of earlier and later Moorish palaces. Enclosed by a fortified wall with 13 defensive towers. Some such as the Torre de la Infanta and Torre de la Cortiva containing elaborate vertical palaces. In miniature, the river Daro passes through a ravine on the north and divides the plateau from the Albaquin district of Granada. Similarly, the Sabica Valley, containing the Alhambra Park, lies on the west and south. And, beyond this valley, the almost parallel ridge of Monte Moro separates it from the Antiquerwela district. Another ravine separates it from the general life. The summer pleasure gardens of the Emir. Salmaran Escobar notes that the later planting of deciduous elms obscures the overall perception of the layout. So a better reading of the original landscape is given in winter when the trees are bare.